Hello. Um, so I got a YouTube AdSense payment and I thought, um, what better way to spend it than uh, on more cream and brown stuff. Now, I might be a little distracted in the first part of this video as I'm actually waiting on UPS coming. Um, what's coming is related to this, so you'll see. Um, but yeah, I saw this on Gumtree. Um, it was up for £100. Do not worry, I did not pay £100. Um, you'll see it's very... I wouldn't say tired, it's just a bit scabby. But I'm noticing the base is very white and unfaded, which is good. Um, original plug, needs a clean again. Um, yeah, it's all whole, didn't get damaged by parcel force. Very similar to my first Cream Henry, which was also from 91. That might be newer, or just a very early one of that. Yeah, it needs a clean. Um, whether it works properly or not, I don't really know. We'll try that later. However, the reason I was after that, this is really not of much interest. But in fact, it's a Henry. Oh, a bit... Oh, no, it's not really scuffed. I think it was dust. Yeah, it's a Henry, so it is of interest. But what was of interest was what else the seller had. Now, in the photo, there wasn't much of this. And I um, kind of got messaged into her and she said, um, yeah, I'll have a look what other Henry stuff I have from my parents' house. And she sends me a photo. Now, the only thing missing from the photo are two HVC ones. Um, I'm going to guess maybe they were stuck and she couldn't get them in the box or um, wasn't room. Because, believe it or not, all of this and that Henry were in that box. I know how. The guy was bringing it down the drive and I'm like, um, there's been a problem. Hmm. Which is also why I didn't film the unboxing because I was in a bit of a panic thinking there was bits missing. And I also got interrupted by a leaflet saying, um, why do we need to put an end to this Tory Brexit? Well, I really don't care. Anyway, so we came to a deal and she's included all of this. Now this is a pneumatic head off a of basil or something. This is really nice. Um, I know it needs a bit of a clean, but it changes so smoothly. You know, good nick. We have another cream head here. Now this is the one I already have, but it is a thousand times better than mine. The neck works. It's in good condition. It's complete, which is good. Then we have another cream head which isn't original to this one, I think that's the original one for this one. Which is in less than ideal condition, but a good service will help. We have some extra ones, I've no idea about this one. Um, that's an odd one. Um, but we have a set of brown ones, which is why I was after this one in particular, and a good brown hose, we'll come for that. You'll see the brown ones are good, we have another bend. They all seem to come with their original bends. The problem with Cream and Brown Henry's is there's loads going about, but none of them are ever complete. Um, which is why half the internet says, eh, Cream and Brown Henry's are so rare, and the other half goes, oh no they're not, I have 12, you know? Um, yeah, so very seldom do you see the hoses and the brown ones. The heads seem to survive, the bends seem to survive, but because these ping off quite easily, you never see them in brown. Anyway, so we have a set of brown ones. Which I already had that, but I didn't have any of those. Thumbs up. A brown hose, which I do have one of, as you know, but it's, again, in less than ideal condition. This one is really good. Um, yeah, nothing wrong with that. And then we have a HVC wand, because um, you had three HVC wands in the photo. I'm going to, like I say, the other two are probably stuck together or something. We have a normal Henry wand and we have a genuine bend. That's quite clean. So we can put all the black stuff in here just now. This head is again of interest to me, but I'm going to just chuck it in there the now, and we can see that now. Put the Henry together. Now the plan is when UPS comes, you'll see what else is here. Then we'll go to the garage and tinker over them and hear them running. But I think it'd be fun if I am. Um, Rudely put you on the floor and exclude you from the conversation. Um, jokes, I think it'd be fun if we just assemble this just to see how it looks. So, that goes in there. Oh, I can't remember how to put Henry together. Can any of you help? Um, well, this brown one needs a clean. Um, I'll move the other cream head just now. And. Breath. I've been talking too much. Wow. 
these ones are really long. Um, <laughs> they are really long. Maybe they're designed for the other head. Are you ready, kids? Ta da! A complete brown set. Yay! Now I have one small tool already. There's another small tool coming. Um, and then all I need are two other parts of the small tool kit. But yeah, that should do us just now until UPS comes, so be with you soon. Well, UPS have been. Um, bit of a spoiler as to what's in here. But basically, this was on eBay. Um, the seller accepted my reasonable offer, um, and I only offered on it because the seller this stopped replying. Um, so I was like, oh no, and I was had my heart set on another cream henry, so I went and got that one as well. Oops, I've been cleaning these heads, you'll see this one is lovely. I think it's only probably ever been used on carpet. Um, this one is, uh, it's okay. It's a bit rough, I need to put the lint strip back on. But yeah, a bit rough and ready that one, but what have we got in here? Um, you'll know that when you see these bags, yeah, I got this one, the seller accepted a nice offer, so oh well. One pound sixty-nine out of Morrison's. Those must be ancient. Um, what else have we got? Well, we have a brown hose. Oh, attached to a brown bend. Now this brown hose looks pretty good. It actually looks pretty clean. Um, is it jammed onto the bend? Ah, it is. Oh no, it's not. It was just stuck on. To give you an idea how long that's probably been stuck on. Yeah. Oh, this is clean. Yeah, I had a suspicion this Henry hasn't been used much. Um, considering the bags are probably twice as old as I am. Now, uh, oh, we have our cream crevice tool. Uh, let's see what this is like. Yeah, bit battered, but better than no cream crevice tool. It's also cracked. Yeah, that's pretty scrapped to be honest. Is it actually pneumatic? Looking at that, I don't know if that's actually pneumatic or not, come to think of it. But it's the right colour, so we'll come well. We have two ones, which I think are original. However, one of them is missing the brown ring. Yeah, I'll just cut you down again. Or I'll pull them out the bubble wrap. I see Seller has packaged it really well. Yeah, so we're missing a brown ring, the other one is really clean. And actually it's a bit different to the other ones I've got. These are 80s ones, the ones I've got are the more 90s type. Um, I've been cleaning the ones as well off the Henry from earlier. And um, one of them's a bit discoloured. Um, so we might have to kind of use one of these ones. Um, here's the forehead, which is filthy, but doesn't look like it's had as much use as the one I've just opened. Um, oh, we've been cleaning. That's nice and bright. Yeah, that's actually not bad at all. Look at the brushes on it. The brushes on it are really good. Um, I actually thought it was faded. I don't think it is. Um, it's obviously really dirty from storage. It's maybe not faded. That one just looks really white after I've cleaned it. Yeah, so except I'm missing brown ring, we've got everything. Um, and of course Henry himself. Now this, I'm hoping it cleans up alright. I was only buying it for the holes really. And I wanted the sticker off the top actually. Two things I bought it for. Uh, I'd love to see it with a bubble wrap. Yes I can. Anyway, well packaged, that's a good thing. Uh, let's just get this apart. So yeah, a bit annoying the crevice tool's cracked. That wasn't described. I think it's original. It feels very small and kind of thin to be genuine. I'm going to guess that's maybe off something else, but, you know, it's a clean crevice tool. A bit of gold is a bit of a clean crevice tool. Now, I'm hoping this is just need a good clean. And like I say, I got a, a quite a good offer. The sale was all right. Well, you get a close up of the sticker. Let's see if I can get out of this bubble wrap. It's got a lot of bubble wrap around it. Come on, we're getting somewhere. Hang on. Is 
this is why I'm not so keen on unboxing this without a tripod especially. Um, oh wow, this Henry looks good. So there's a couple of things I've spotted. Of course the sticker is very good. We have the 1000 watt motor thing and the wheels are good um, under the filth. It's not got a date, so probably about 88, 89 I'm going to say. 90. Oh wow, it's got all its stickers on it. So if that cleans up well, that top casing could be a keeper. Um, it has the older type filter in it. Oh! I just made a funny noise there, but wow. That's cool. <laughs> I didn't know what was coming with that. Um, yeah. Gonna have to be careful and clean that up. Um, yeah, I don't think this has actually been used much. It must have just been stored for a while. Hmm. Um, yeah, here he is. It's in pretty good neck, it just needs such a clean. I might go grab a cloth and we'll see how this top cleans up, see if it's going to be shiny or if it's going to be dull like that. I don't know how it's going to be. Hang on. Right, you're about to be the first people to see these running. I've not switched them on yet. Side note, I've went over this for a cloth and it looks like it's cleaning up alright. Also, I've went over the sticker, that's practically mint. I think the sticker is brown actually, to match. Um, anyway, I've got them on my nationwide base. Let's just you know, plug them both in. I haven't tried them, but they're old Henry's. I've got faith. Right, it's off. What happens when we turn it on? Uh, how are we going to do this? Right, the bearings are awful on it. <laughs> it sounds pretty good otherwise. Um, original plug too. Nice. Um, let's just reel this in. If you give me a moment. So, I'm thinking, I was really happy with my cream burn Henry. I was only wanting tools, but I'm thinking maybe... The lid off this one might be getting kept because it's got all three stickers um, and that bag, that bag in there is lovely. Um, I'll never use it because it's reusable but, you know, cool to have. This one, I've not plugged this one in yet either. Um, it's a bit dustier under there so it might blow dust out. So we might actually set this one up so that it's already switched on and pointing to the... Pointing to the Well, that runs perfectly. That's interesting. So this one, which looks to have had little use, I think it's probably been in a garage or something, judging by how filthy it is, is manky. This one, which was in a house, according to the seller, runs better. So there you go. And that one's had more dust up it, which is fun. Um, yeah, pleased with that. Yeah, well chuffed I got that one actually, because it's got a few things that I don't already have on mine. So I think it probably was worthwhile. There's a cream bread Henry on eBay just now for £300. It's been it's been bid up to £300 that is. Um, I doubt it's going to sell because I think it's like a one feedback bidder who's on it. There's already been bids retracted. Yeah, but £300 quid is a lot of money. So yeah, might sell one with a burn hose. So that's pretty good. Let's have another quick look at this one. I didn't bring the tools out but I'm sure you'll see it again. Um, I actually don't know if I like the face. I will probably end up changing it. Wow these wheels are good. Ah, the back one's moving not so much. Ah, pretty good. My current one's got pretty good wheels in it. It looks like the casing's cleaning up alright under the filth. The handle's good. Um, yeah, let's have another closer look at the bag as well. Because um, that is cool. That felt is fairly clean. Yeah, Pneumatic International. Um, it is a loose fit. Not bad. I don't know if I'm going to wash this or not because won't this Pneumatic logo just come right off? 
I don't know. So I'm undecided on how we're going to deal with that. And then this one doesn't have a bag in it. We've seen this one, I think, in close detail. But it runs perfectly, which is good to know. So I'll need to figure out what I'm going to do. Uh, as it stands, I'm actually contemplating just going in up to my room, grabbing my current cream and brown hair and just chucking it on eBay. Um, and then working something out with these two. But I don't know. Uh, uh, my burn hose is pretty mess, so it'll probably go with the scrappiest one. I don't know how this is going to clean up. Um, they might just wash off no problem, or it might be a bit tatty. But cosmetically both aren't too bad. Yeah, I was kind of sceptical of this because it looked yellow in the photos. It didn't seem to be that faded. You know, it looks it looks pretty white to me. So, we shall see. Thank you for watching this quite long video. See you in the next one.